So I started off by painting my canvas green. Now I'm just going to take some black paint and make a big swooshy messy circle. And then fill it in. And just go crazy with it. You can have it however big or small or lumpy or smooth you want it. I'm making mine fuzzy. Very fuzzy. And now I'm going to let that dry and add a second layer. Now that the second layer is dry, I'm going to add eight spidery legs, four on each side. So there's one, two, three, four. The lines. And then that one go down. Connect that one, connect this one, and now we'll do that on the other side as well. Now that those legs are dry, we can give our spider some eyes. Now this is the fun part, because this is where you get to choose how many eyes the spider has. Because spiders can have tons of eyes. I'm only going to give my spider two. You could give yours three or eight or sixteen eyes if you even wanted to. I'm just going to make a big white dot. And now this is a creepy spider, so I'm going to make the other eye a small white dot. Now that I've let those dry... We get to do the fun part, which is choosing what the eyes look like. Now, my actual spider's eyes won't look like this, but I'm going to make it look like a big creepy eyeball. So on the little one, I'm going to fill it in a green circle in the center of it. I'm going to the big one. I'm going to put a little green dot and let those dry. Now we're going to take some black, now that those are dry, and add some pupils. And the eye. Now we're going to let that dry so we don't smudge it. Now all we have left is a few little details. Okay, I'm going to take an itty bitty brush. I'm going to give my little spider a mouth, and you don't have to do this. But I think it looks super cute. Little mouth so you can bite stuff. And then... I'm going to make it so he's hanging down from the ceiling on a little web. So 
glass touch. A few little dots. In his eye. And boom! A spooky spider.